What's the secret to becoming a professional novelist? It's actually very, very simple. It is that professional novelists treat writing as a job. They have a very strict schedule, they have deadlines, they have meetings, they lay everything out very systematically. They know when they're gonna write, they know when they're gonna finish, they know when they're gonna submit it to agents, to publishers, they have everything mapped out. They have a notebook with every time they've submitted their book to an agent, a manager, uh, a publishing house, a competition. It's all documented and treated very seriously. They keep their writing date. They don't skip it. They're not doing it as a hobby. They don't just write when the, the feeling, you know, comes acro across them. They sit down for their two or three hours a day and they always write. So it's all about discipline, commitment, and the main thing, deadlines. They say, I'm going to finish this book in four months or this first draft, and they do. And they plan it out. They're like, okay, I know I need to write 200 pages. That means I've got to write eight or 10 pages a day for the next few months. And then I'm going to have my 200 page novel. Then I'm going to work on draft two. I'm going to give myself another three months to work on draft two. Then I'm going to give myself another three months to work on draft three. Then I'm going to set it to send it to my agent, get some feedback, rewrite it. It's all mapped out. It's all a bit boring and serious, but that is the difference between hobby writers, and professional writers. It's not actually being published. There's a lot of fantastic writers out there who have books with agents right now that still haven't got them published that are excellent professional writers. So don't take that as meaning you're not a professional if you haven't been published yet. The difference is you sit down, you do the work every day. You're committed, disciplined, and concentrated. Good luck.